mention of that four letter word since most of us racing to the grocery store to stock up. I'm on the hunt to find out what's in your shopping cart for Snowmageddon 2016. These cars are about to be annihilated by some of the biggest trucks you have ever seen. Unfortunately, I don't have that much power, but I try. Hello from the other side. That's my Sammy <laughs> I think that was beautiful. That, Thank you. That voice that just came out. I, mean, I don't didn't even, even know, know you had happened. that. It's like I ate a Muppet. Now that, my friends, is a biscuit. But not just any biscuit. It's a cat head biscuit because it's so huge. It's as big as a cat's head. Obviously, I've got to take a bite of this, guys. Look at that. Cheese, Cuban pork, fries, and barbecue sauce. I mean, amazing. Speaking of things to eat, uh -oh. Burger King is launching a new product here, the Whopperito. Oh yeah! They're turning the Whopper into a burrito. I mean, what do you think about that? Would you eat that? Look at that thing. Oh, yeah. That's massive, isn't it? <laughs> but that's perfect for a guy with a big appetite. I like yeah, it. Yeah, you're all over that? I'm all over it. What's trending right now is Michael Phelps. Of course, you know, he just won his 19th gold medal, but right. other than that, his face. Right. Hashtag Phelps face. There was this picture, they caught him, but you know, focusing before his swim, you kind know, like that this, kind right? of face, just, just, just look, very yeah. serious. Look at him, look at he's him. so intense, so focused, but is that what it takes, you think? That's what it takes to be a gold medalist. The death stare, I love that. <laughs> I'm getting ready to head inside the locker room to ask the Panthers some fun facts maybe you don't know. We're getting up close with the Panthers as they get ready for the Super Bowl. I went one-on-one -on -one with some of the players to ask the hard-hitting questions we all want to know. Like, what's on their pre-game playlist? I listen to Dale, Hello from the other side. I listen to everything. I like Sam Smith. He's a real good singer. Uh, uh, you know, I'm not ashamed to admit it. It's all over from Christian music to country music to, to 80s. What's their favorite thing to eat after a win? Uh, a steak, of course. You always got to cook a steak and, uh, of course, a little bang bang shrimp here and there from uh, bonefish. I eat anything that they put in front, of me, in front of me after a game because I don't eat much uh, before the game. So I'm an Italian and Mexican. Those are my two faves. And what's one thing we don't know about them? Everybody likes to play golf here and there, you know, in the off time. Um, you a big golfer? Are you good at it? No, heck no. <laughs> I suck at golf, <laughs> but I do like to go out and just uh, hit the ball. I love food, so all I watch is the Food Network and the Travel Channel. One thing you may not know is that Roman Harper is a pretty good reporter. Here, ask him these questions. All right. Here we go. So does your dancing on the field, because we've seen you dance a lot, how does that translate off the field? It translates. You know, I just I dance on it. So, you know, and I, like, you know, I'm more of a chill type of, like... So you're one of the like, wall hugger guys? No, no, no. I just am in my own, own little world. Let's just do the dab thing. Yeah, do the dab? I'm not going to do it. Why not? You, you do the dab. Do it together. I'm not going to do it. I'm interviewing. I'm working. Very focused. One thing I learned, these guys just like to have a good time off the field and work hard on the field. Maybe the champagne will pop after, after the Super Bowl, but other than that, you know, it's focused and ready to go. This is Roman Harper, number 41 on the field, number one in your heart, signing out right here from Spartanburg to Charlotte, baby, we love you. For Scene on 7, I'm Vanessa de la Viña. One of the new and exciting menu items here is the Chapulinas Taco, which has fresh corn, Peruvian peppers, and that's not meat in there. Those are garlic butter crickets. It's uh, pronounced <laughs> Worcestershire. 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 It's uh, written down here. But I, I never knew. Was it Worcestershire? Worcestershire? Everyone Wo says it differently. I, I used think. to say Worcestershire. You just make it up. <laughs>